Welcome back everyone to the third episode of ETB Randomizer. Today we're going to be pulling another 15 booster packs of the Pokemon Go Astral Radiance or Evolving Skies to try and get our chase cards. Finally get our chase cards. But before we start the video, please leave a like to the video if you like Pokemon content and subscribe to the channel if you like Pokemon or like One Piece. The first booster pack will be a Pokemon Go booster pack. So of course, as you will know by now, we are chasing a Radiant Blastoise and an alternate artwork of talking about Blastoise, there is a Blastoise, and an alternate artwork of Mewtwo. Of course, the Rainbow Rares and all the other packs too. Another Pokemon Go. A set. Pack. I mean. Of course, the Rainbow Rares and everything are also cards that we still chase. Like everyone, of course. Pupitar, there is something in my back. Mosquito or something. A Charmeleon Reverse and a Mewtwo V-Star. That is already a good start for Pokemon Go. We already have this card by the way, but nevertheless, it's still a nice card to pull. Evolving Skies with a nice artwork, of course. Fairy Evolution. Let's not ruin if it's a good pack or not. Oh, my bad. I think I already ruined it. Not sure. Lombre. Hiding in his swamp. Lantern, Reverse Hollow. By the way, Lantern is one of my favorite. Oh, a Duratalon V Max. I think I pulled this one in my last video as well. Or in the first video. I am not quite sure anymore. Astro Radiance with the origin form of Palkia. Will this be a sign that we will get the origin form of Palkia? Alternate artwork, that is. It's already quite annoying opening. Let's not ruin it. Leaf Energy, Electrode, Hisuian Electrode, that is. So if you're still what a hey, Voltorb, if you're still watching, this Sedgwi V Star, Hisuian this Sedgwi V Star, and let's take a closer look at this because it's the first time that I pull this card. It is quite nice, to be honest with you. Also, the centering is not too bad. Centering is. 9 out of 10, if you ask me. So that is, all, that is already at least a V-Star out of every set. That is a lot better than our last video, where we basically pu pulled just one good card, I thought. A Pokemon Go card again. A booster pack, I mean. Or Pokemon Go cards. If you're pulling cards from the Pokemon Go set, that seems a little bit obvious. But anyway, let's see. Ariados and Gyarados. Let's 
still a gift as a sleeve. You never know how expensive holographic cards can become in the future. So you better be safe than sorry. Another Pokemon Go card. Uh, boost pack. Which is not bad because I do want the Radiant Blastoise very, very much. Another Ariados. Also, let's see if the last one was a Ditto, but was not a Ditto card. Squirtle, Melmetal, Bidoof, Tranquil, and Snorlax. And this card actually, I think, has quite a bit of potential. Because it is a nice artwork where it blocks your doorway. So let's see. Astral Radiance, by the way, with the Dialga origin form as the artwork. Maybe Dialga wants to become one of ours. As elf, I think that is one of the three legendaries that I do not have. As elf, as elf, evolve this guy's there. Yoshi Cash, Standler, Quillfish, Cider, Togepi, Gutsy Pickaxe, and Overquill. Another Astro Radiance. Also, I put these cards wrong. Give me a minute. Put them in the wrong staple. Important for sorting later. Which I do not do on camera. Because that would be boring. That is the only boring part about Trying to pull good Pokemon cards. The sorting. Hey, hello, Eevee. Unfortunately, in the wrong set. Oh, a Radiant Heatron! Or Heatron, or. Yeah, probably Heatron. Radiant Heatron and a Rapidash in the back. We did not have this card yet, and oh my god, this actually has a really, really nice shine to it. I'm not sure if you can pick that up with the current lighting because a light bulb of mine actually said screw you you will not record a video today but I said eh, oh well I will try it anyway and that is a nice astral radiance pulling again so astral radiance taking the lead again like the first episode Pokemon Go pack now. Can Pokemon Go win for once? Solrock, Eevee, Pikachu, Squirtle, Squirtle, Bidoof, Redita. Reverse Zapdos and another Tyranitar. I told you in the last video that Tyranitar loves me. And it is one of my top three favorite Pokemon. Nevertheless, pulling him this much, I did not ask for. Oh well. Maybe by the end of the Pokemon Go pulling. When I finally get a Blastoise, if I pulled enough packs for a Blastoise, maybe I can put my whole wall behind me full of Tyranitars. I did not do the card trick, did I? Oh yeah, I did. Sorry for the confusion. 
War Turtle, which actually, if you look in the back, has like a house and a, um, I don't know how to say it, and like an, uh, a nice artwork. You know what I mean. Galissapod and Articuno, also not bad. You do not pull an Articuno all day. So let's see. Card is falling. Palkia. Can you give me the artistic alternate artwork of Palkia? Pretty please. I feel like I will need to sneeze soon. And there's a cat at my legs. I'm wondering who. Astro Radiance. Kylo Swine. Ponyta. Cricketot. But oh, I'm sorry guys. I ruined a little bit. I screwed up a little bit. A Standler and a Weirdeer Trainer Gallery. Which is actually pretty nice. Also did not pull that one yet. Not a trainer gallery. So definitely Astro Radiance and a Cleaver, which I also did not have yet. Believe it or not, after three booster boxes. So Astro Radiance definitely taking the lead with the Radiant. A holographic that I did not pull yet. A trainer gallery card and what was it? A VMAX? Review will be later. Typhlosion. Hisuian Typhlosion. Which, in my opinion, is... Let me open it first. Yeah. Hisuian Typhlosion, in my opinion, don't take this the wrong way, in my opinion, is an upgrade to the regular Typhlosion, which, bad cornering there, which, again, is a stat-wise, stat-wise, a rip-off of, of course, um, Charm. Charilla, uh, the, 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 cannot even speak my favorite Pokemon's name anymore, Charizard. Oh my god, and talked about Typhlosion. Typhlosion V-Star is right there. When you talk about the devil, you pull the devil. A nice card, again, of the Astro Radiance. So this is all of the same box, by the way. All from the Astro Radiance box. From the three last episodes, so it is a very, very good Astro Radiance box. And another Pokemon Go. Pokemon Go actually not doing too bad today. Probably because we are not pulling any Evolving Skies today as well. Or about to ruin it again. Pupitar, Slowpoke, Larvitar, a Palm, Spinarak, a Radiant Blastoise! Finally, we pulled a Radiant Blastoise, the last Radiant out of the set. About time. This is pretty cool. My goodness. This is finally what I have been waiting for. I'm not sure if there is like a little bit of denting. I cannot really say it's denting, but it's like a little imperfection in the card. So if you grade this card, you will probably get a nine 
Apart from that, it looks pretty neat. Near mint, for sure. So probably PSA 9 because of the dent on the back. Maybe if it's a good day, a PSA 10 even. But this is finally the car that we were waiting for. We finally pulled it, guys. Finally, in our set, we have a Radiant Blastoise. So two Radiant cards today is not bad at all. So now I'm not sure anymore. Which set wins? Pokemon Go or Astro Radiance? I should look up the prices. Because I do not know them all by heart. Unless there is something very, very exciting coming up in the next two packs, so in this pack or the next one, I do not think that Evolving Skies is gonna make a comeback or we should see like a real, real nice card coming. Mel Metal. Also, we did not pull a lot of Evolving Skies. Probably because it's the same box and we pull a lot, and I mean a lot, of Evolving Skies in the last video. So this is an Evolving Skies with a Drelodon. So actually, let's take a closer look. So yeah, that is basically a Skyscraper Pokemon. I should actually read about the lore in the Pokédex. So, Evolving Skies. Can this one pack get us the win? I think not. But you never know if we pull the top card or the top three cars even, we can actually still win. C dot. And that is it for the video. Altaria, non-holographic. So today, actually, I do not know which one wins. Kind of a hard choice. So of course, Evolving Skies with the Duraludon, VMAX is not winning because we already pulled that one. But, out of the Pokemon Go set, we pulled a Radiant Blastoise, of course Melmetal, Snorlax, Articuno, Tyranitar, and another Snorlax and a Gyarados. But then we also pulled Blastoise and Mewtwo V-Star. So these are the top three cards that we pulled. But, you have the Astro Radiance with the Typhlosion V-Star, Weirdeer, Trainer Gallery, Cleaver Holographic, which is one of the harder holographic cards to pull in my opinion, because as I said, I already pulled three. I opened three boxes and never had that one. Radiant Heatran and a Decedui V-Star. So actually I think that is already clear which the winner is. Because an opening with two V-Stars, a Radiant and a Trainer Gallery has the upper hand even if you put a, a normal Radiant Blastoise. Well, not normal, but if you put a Radiant Blastoise and a Mewtwo V-Star together I don't think it tips. Five good cards out of Astro Radiance. So obviously Astro Radiance won again. So that is two of the past three videos of the ETB randomizer that they won. So in my opinion, Astro Radiance is a set you should hunt. Bye.